Hey, today we're going to program a Subaru WRX to open the garage door. Stay tuned. What's up? I wrote the pistons, there's blood in the engine, that's fine. Programming your Subaru to open your garage door is super easy to do. A couple things. We need the car on and we need a garage door opener remote. Follow me to the first step. Check it out. All right, so once you're in the car, you got your rear view mirror right here. Right underneath it, you have three buttons. One, two, three. Those are your home link buttons. So first step. So you want to put your finger on the one and the three. Press both of them in. When you press them both in, you can see that little house come on the mirror with that orange light. We're going to continue to hold that until that orange light starts blinking. Okay, there we go. So now we can let go. You have to have a remote control to do this. Attention, you have to have a remote control to do this. Some cars have a built-in universal home link, which you don't need a remote to do it, but this one you have to. So what you wanna do is take your remote three to five inches away. You're gonna pick what button you want. I'm gonna choose one. Press both those buttons in at the same time and you're gonna hold it and continue to hold it. As you're holding both buttons, you're waiting for the orange light on the mirror to turn green. Let go. Okay. Just let the door go all the way down. Now let's open it again. Next step, you want to go into the garage. You're going to go to your garage door opener and locate the learn smart button. Older Genie machines, the learn button will be either on the back side or on the front side, clearly labeled. New Genies, it will be on the bottom, which it's called a program button. So if you have a newer Chamberlain or LiftMaster machine, you can actually go over to the wall console over here, flip your lid open. You're going to see two buttons, learn and lock. That learn button, let's press it two times, once, twice. Now let's go back to the car. Now that we're back at the car, let's take that number one button that we programmed the remote to. We're gonna press it in firmly once. Twice. And our garage door is moving. So that's it, super easy to do. Like I said, you need a remote to do this and uh, you'll be fast on your way. Bingo. Thanks for dropping in. I uh, hope this little lesson helped you all out there with your uh, Subaru. So uh, thanks, and we'll talk to you soon. Peace out. One, two, three, four!